saw miscellaneous. I'm from Orange County, California. Some things I like doing is like going to the beach, thrifting, going to the mall. Some things I do in my spare time is like hang out with family or go hiking or like shopping with friends. Um, I also like putting together outfits. My name's Lisa Salinas. I'm currently in Orange County, California. I grew up in New York. I am a mother of three, a uh, military veteran of 13 years, and now I'm a business broker. I suffer with migraines and so does my teenage daughter. When I first started experiencing migraines, I was like about nine, and I didn't really know what it was at first. I just was like kind of confused, but like it was like a really strong pain. And it was like something I never felt before. I believe the first time I noticed she was about nine years old. Um, I wasn't convinced that she had a migraine issue because I thought she was just too young. Um, she kept telling me, oh, my head's hurting. I think I have a migraine. But I thought she was pretty much just emulating me. But then I realized that she was sensitive to light and sound and, you know, she'd get nauseous and have some vomiting. And so I realized that she's probably suffering from migraines like I do. It like kind of felt like sharp needles like on the side of my head and I got like really dizzy and I was just like oh maybe like I need to eat or something but like after like I ate and stuff like it still didn't get better. I tend to get migraines like three times a week and usually like I get like a migraine that like doesn't go away no matter like what medicine I take at least once a week. We try to relieve the pain through uh, sleep over-the-counter medication, water intake, exercise, anything we can do to pretty much just stay healthy and um, avoid any triggers for the not for our migraines. Migraines like interfere with my life by sometimes it'll just like slow me down when I'm working or if I'm doing schoolwork, like I won't be able to concentrate on it as much or I'll just get like really low energy around people. But usually I just like will stop talking to people after I get a migraine because like interacting with conversation is like kind of too much for me to focus on. I would say my child's quality of life has definitely been affected by migraines. Um, sometimes we'd have to cancel things, um, you know, family plans or when she wants to go hang out with friends and just extracurricular things such as dance and singing. Hard for her for school, because you, know, you know, she'd sleep in late because of the pain and then you know, it, it affects how much time she gets to study because when you know, she's in a lot of pain, she can't study her, her coursework. Usually like my parents are like used to it by now because like I get them so often. So they just like tell me like to take some medicine, like eat something and drink a lot of water. I think that like, my parents are like a little upset that I get them just cause like they have to see their kid go through like a lot of pain. To know that my child suffers with migraines makes me feel helpless um, because there is not a whole lot we can do. Um, we do give her over the counter medication. She doesn't have any prescribed migraine medicine. Um, and sometimes it works, but about half the time it doesn't work. So, you know, I just have to try to comfort her with, you know, letting her rest in her room in a dark, quiet, you know, place and, you know, bring her water, bring her her food and just, you know, give her some time to let it subside and it can go for days. Um, the most frustrating thing about getting a migraine is it like it affects my social life because like I just won't want to go out as often or I won't like be like my bubbly self around people just cause like, it's like really painful and really exhausting. And so that just kind of like upsets me sometimes cause I can't be myself when like migraines happen. My hope for the future of her migraine suffering is that something will come in science that will uh, be more effective with ridding the pain when it starts or even just eliminating migraines altogether.